Welcome back folks to a brand new video. If you enjoyed the beautiful beaches and those tiny villages and of course delicious food, then the south of France should be on top of your bucket list. So let's take a look at 10 beautiful towns to visit in the south of France. Now before you even watch this video, don't forget to hit that like button, obviously for the YouTube algorithm. Number one, Maton. The colours of Maton, oranges, yellows and reds, can only mean one thing. You've definitely reached the French Riviera. It's the last stop on the Côte d'Azur and although it's incredibly popular with visitors, it often gets overshadowed by its neighbours, Nice and Cannes. However, this town is perfect size for a weekend getaway and a great base from which to explore the wonderful coastline. It's an area around the old port of Maton which is the most attractive. Arles, a city on the Rhone River in the Provence region of southern France, famous for its short but memorable association with Vincent van Gogh. Now van Gogh stayed in Arles for only 18 months, yet during this time he produced some of the most famous paintings of landscapes and real life in and around the town. Arles is widely regarded as the heart of Provence, an excellent little city with beautiful 18th and 19th century mansion houses and old Roman buildings. It's really busy in the summer and all the pavement cafes and restaurants are actually full of people. Now I went in late March and it was still quite busy, but it only takes about 20 minutes to walk around from one side to the other, so it's still worth the trip. Saint Paul de Vence. Probably one of the loveliest of all the perched villages that you'll find in the south of France. Now, this tiny little village became a magnet for artists and art lovers in the 1920s when a group of impressionist painters rediscovered this worn down town. But now, today, Saint Paul de Vence is one of the Cote d'Azur's most famous treasures, and one you should definitely visit. It's a very easy day trip from Nice, and because it's small, it doesn't take too long to visit. So don't forget to check out the ramparts. You can walk on top of the walls when the gates are open, and this is a great way to see the countryside. Number four, Ez. Ez is a beautiful hilltop medieval village in the south of France, between Monaco and Nice. The village is famous for its spectacular views, its impressive architecture and its stunning geographical location just above the French Riviera. Now the reason why the views are so amazing, basically from any vantage point, is that the village is located on a hilltop on a high cliff above 1,400 feet above sea level. Walking around the narrow streets of this town is like being back in the Middle Ages. So be prepared to walk up the hill quite a lot and down the hill on the way back. So in this little town you do need good walking shoes, especially to walk around these medieval pathways. Try taking the bus from Nice number 82 or 112. Number 5. Perpignan. Perpignan is a southern French city near the Mediterranean coast and the border with Spain. The beach is just around 15 minutes away 
Scenic walks in the foothills of the Pyrenees are just 20 minutes away. Or you can hop over to Spain for some cheap shopping in just half an hour. And if you fancy a trip to the mountains, that's only an hour and a half drive, which will take you to the ski slopes. So when you add the vineyards, the orchards, the lakes, the rivers, the lagoons, you realize how spoilt for choice you really are. Plenty of highlights and reasons why to visit this wonderful city. Next up is Pochcurol. Pochcurol Island is another great place to visit in the south of France. And this is just a short ferry ride from Yeah. I mean, that's such a cool name. Yeah. So you should go there to experience the white sand beaches and the locally owned restaurants. But to really get into an island state of mind, rent a bike and pedal your way around the trails on the island to see all the sights, such as the Fort St. Agat. This is more of a place to come to relax rather than to party, so plan your next peaceful retreat on Bocherol Island. Carcassonne. The Languedoc region is like nowhere else in France, thanks to its sun-baked beaches, forested peaks and density of the vineyards. It's perhaps best exemplified by the medieval town of Carcassonne. Overlooking the river, the town's main lure is a 10th century citadel complete with ramparts and a drawbridge. A very picturesque town to visit. Situated in an area beyond Nice, picturesque Pion is one of the most beautiful villages of the French Riviera. It's known for its medieval stone houses and incredible mountain surroundings. It's very off the beaten path. And two of the ways, or both ways that you could visit is via public transport, but then you need to hike at least 35 minutes to the village. However, if you rent a car, you don't need to hike at all. Trust me, the views are totally worth it. commune in the southeastern region of France. Now there are quite a few amazing attractions to look into, such as the caves, saint Fermain, which offers a fun adventure that is appropriate for any member of the family. Chateau de Gord is a very old castle in this commune and it's one of the more beautiful historic sites. Another small area in France, but again worth the visit to escape the hordes of tourists that visit this country. Aix-en-Provence When visiting Aix-en-Provence, you will automatically feel immersed in the lifestyle of southern France. With its vibrant open-air markets, bustling outdoor cafes, and the refreshing fountains that adorn the public squares. Now in most towns in Provence, the ambience is slow-paced and relaxing. So this is the type of trip where you just want to wander around, 
sit on park benches and then just take in the environment. Even local residents have perfected the art of relaxing with leisurely meals and strolls along gracefully tree-lined streets. The highlight here would be to check out the Old Town. And of course, that lovely tree-lined avenue with so many sidewalk cafes and restaurants. <laughs>